Hello, my name is Richard Taylor. I live in Houston, Texas. So the eyes of Texas are upon you now. And I have dementia probably of the Alzheimer's type. Most folks I've met who are living with the symptoms of dementia, and I've spoken to and listened to hundreds and hundreds of them, they begin their journey living with the symptoms of dementia, following in the footsteps of millions who have already heard the words, you have dementia, probably of this or that type. We focus on the very end stage of dementia. We tell ourselves we act as if we've lost control of our lives, our dreams, our relationships. We begin to wait for the day our suffering ends and we will die, confused and alone. Personally, I cried for two weeks after I heard these words. Personally, I had no idea why I was crying. The stigmas of dementia incubated between my ears, and they do the same with almost everyone walking the earth. Kate Swaffer was no different from any one of us. What sets her apart? What makes it important that as many people as possible read her book? is her amazing insights into what, why, and how most of us are overwhelmed, frightened, confused, and afraid of our fate once we have heard the diagnosis. She brings a genuineness, an openness, an ethos which is comforting, informing, and deeply both positive and reassuring that we are okay today. Our humanity is still and will always be intact. We can still and each have a future filled with opportunities for living a full and meaningful life, even when we're living with the symptoms of dementia. She not only practices what her book preaches, she lives it. Kate brings a palpable sense of urgency to understanding and accepting those of us living with dementia and to the rest of her readers. It's an urgency that says, stand up and speak out for heaven's sakes. Embrace your life. Do not become a victim of circumstances. To others, such as carers, professionals, friends, and family, she asks, sometimes demands, that they accept us as whole people. If you want to know of a contemporary profile in courage, if you want to know dementia from the inside out, read this book. Thanks. I'm Richard, and I'm living with dementia. Goodbye.